Now I will say that for some reason this side, it kind of looks like my ends aren't as, um, what's the word, like moisturized as I would want them to be. It could have been the way that I braided it. I'm not sure. Again, this is my first braid out. I'm used to twist out. <laughs> channel i'm dd if this is your first time tuning in go ahead and click the subscribe button for all my return subscribers thank you guys so much okay so if you've been following my channel for a while then you know that the majority of the styles that i do are like twist styles or i just put my hair in twist because i think that i'm able to retain the most moisture with twist so it's 2019 new year new me well not really new me but new year so i said you know what i'm going to try a braid out so this is my very first braid out um the products that i used were from shea moisture so if you are interested in how i accomplished this braid out then go ahead and stay tuned okay so before we get into the actual video i just wanted to go over the products that you'll see in the video the first one well let me say this both of the products are from uh, shea moisture's jamaican black castor oil line the first one is the strengthen grow and restore leave-in conditioner with shea butter peppermint and keratin the second one has the same ingredients as well i think but um, this was my first time using this particular product. And when you open it, I like the fact that you get a lot, let me say that. When you open it, the texture of the product is similar to the moisturizing lotion that I'm about to show you. See, it's kind of loosey-goosey, hanky-panky. But, um, so I put this on from root to tip. Let me see what the directions are, because I didn't even read the directions. I just did what I was going to do. Did my deals on. Okay, let me see. The directions say apply to clean, towel dried hair, work a generous amount of product in from the root to the ends, gently comb through for even distribution. Okay, so cool. So I did this. So I used this first. Then I used the um, Strengthen and Restore Styling Lotion, again with the same ingredients shea butter, peppermint, Lord, there I go with that peppermint country, peppermint, and apple cider vinegar. And this is what it looks like. And this is like one of my staple products. So this went on second and I did the same thing. I put this on from root to tips and then I put on um, some, I put, then I sealed everything with olive oil. Without further ado, I'm going to um, go ahead and play the demo video for you guys so you can see exactly how I did everything. So, here we go.
back. As you can see, I kind of did my little part on this side. I think I actually like it better on this side. Um, what I'm going to do is I'll probably get some type of oil or something and put it on the ends because I do feel like my ends are a little dry. Um, I'm going to say I still prefer twist outs over braid outs. I'm not saying I won't ever do a braid out again because I probably will, but I just feel like my preference is more twist out. Um, you guys, let me see, leave a comment below and tell me what you think. You have any products, um, that you think that I should try, then leave that below as well. As always, again, thank you for tuning in. You could be anywhere else, but you came and stopped by to watch my video. I appreciate it. Um, and so until next time, talk to you guys later. Bye.